Elgato's Stream Decks are nifty little keypads that can come in really handy whether you're trying to be more productive at your desk or you're streaming. But without the accompanying software, they're trash. My name is Yadullah, you're watching Candid or Technology and in this video we're talking about how you can fix Elgato's Stream Deck going unresponsive. If your Stream Deck isn't responding, uh, it can be kind of a worrisome thing but you don't need to worry too much about that. The first solution in this case is to force restart the Stream Deck software and you can do that by launching the Task Manager first up. So right click your Windows Start menu and head over to Task Manager. And then uh, in the processes, we're just going to search for the Stream Deck process. Uh, as you can see, it's running uh, right here in the background. Once you're here, right click it and then click on end task. Now I can't do it right now because uh, it will force my Stream Deck to restart and I need it for switching these scenes. But once you've uh, stopped the Stream Deck process from here, you can go back and launch it from the start menu once again to make sure that you get, uh, that you restart the program and that the freeze or unresponsiveness goes away. The next step is to run uh, the Stream Deck program as an administrator. Now this requires a couple of things that you have to do. So the first one is that we're going to search for the Stream Deck software in the Windows Start menu. As you can see, it's right here. I'm going to right click it and then click on Open File Location. This will take us to uh, the shortcut that the Start menu uses. We're going to right click and click on open file location once again and now we'll reach the stream deck dot executable file that is the main executable here. Right click this, head over to properties. In here click on compatibility and now you have to check two options. Run this program as an administrator and disable full screen optimizations. Go ahead and click apply then click ok and now when you restart your stream deck uh, software after killing it in the task manager if it's already open. Uh, the errors and uh, unresponsiveness should have gone. Finally, and this is a little bit of a weird one, but a lot of users have reported that if they're using their Stream Deck program on their secondary monitor, it tends to freeze. I don't understand why this is the why this happens, and there have been no explanations from uh, Elgato's end as well. But uh, as you can see, if I show you my displays. You can see that I have two displays and uh, my primary monitor is actually display number two. So just make sure that you keep it on your primary monitor. There is no sort of solution here. You can try switching primary monitors if uh, to see if that helps. But uh, as long as you can drag the Stream Deck program out on your uh, primary monitor, uh, especially if you're opening it and you have a small window to get it up there then uh, you should be fine but just keep in mind to run the stream deck software on your primary monitor if nothing else works for you and the unresponsiveness should have been gone if you like these videos consider subscribing give us a thumbs up press the bell icon and tell us in the comments below if we were able to help you out if you'd like to know more about tech visit our website candid.technology follow us on social media follow me on instagram or twitter and we will see you in the next video